Guys, are you sick and tired from grinding Outriders non-stop, dying and not leveling up your world tier as you should? Of course, as cherry on top of the cake, you will not receive any loot whatsoever, especially at early stages in the game. So we gonna fix this issue my brother, I will show you how you can get early epics and legendaries, you heard me right, with this method you can get legendaries as well, I understand that you could buy some stuff at vendors, but it's not worth it my man, it costs a lot, and with this leveling up you will not be able to optimize your gear so quickly, because you need crafting materials, so welcome to insanity! Who is that good looking bastard? Of course Butcher in the building, warm welcome to my channel and today I will show you how you can get legendary and epic items very early and this one is absolutely ridiculous, I modded it with Voodoo tier 3 mod, super strong assault rifle, but guys the best farming method in the game right now of course is hunting, it helps you hunt some kind of creatures, animals, how it looks, it looks just like that. You will see some skeletons and you need to start the hunt. Basically you can find these activities at each world section or part of the map. These side quests are really really short and you can have a lot of good items. You can deconstruct and get materials, you can sell them and buy epic items at vendors or you can get legendaries or epics by yourself. And brother, trust me, one friendly tip, please, if you are at world tier 5 or 6, stay there. Farm, hunt, do some hunting for maybe one hour or two, get your gear, level up and only then move forward. What happened to me, as you know brother, we received Outriders demo and their maximum world tier was number 5. Of course I reached it and I started to play this game and as turned it out, I couldn't pick up anything by playing story mission. I reached level 14 and I still was using my demo items. It's ridiculous, you will not get any reward whatsoever by playing story mission. And by dying, you will receive such huge punishment. Basically, if you're gonna die a couple times, you can lose whole level. To me, it's ridiculous, brother. So please, at early stages, do couple hunts, get some epics, level up your gear and then move forward. It's really safe way and trust me, that's by far the quick, quickest way how you can improve your world tier. And specialization or, or class, I would recommend go for Technomancer or Trickster. These two classes are really strong. There is nothing to it, you have to be aggressive and you will heal yourself. Anyway guys, it depends on your preference, but please, if you want to have really nice gear, epic items and legendaries, do hunting. It's really worth your time. Bosses are pretty much interesting, but at, I'm at level 24, 26 right now, yeah, it's... Of course, by that time you will most likely already fought those uh, hunts, but anyway brother, uh, that's like I said, easy leveling up, you will get your gear, you can sell it, get materials by deconstructing them, and you have a really nice shot for legendaries, but other than that, story mode is really really tedious, punishment, for, for my opinion, is out of this world, I think they should reduce punishment for losing or dying. I understand if this mechanics would be at the latest part in the game, maybe at world tier 15, yeah I understand that, it's hardcore you know, but at level 5 or 4, why do you need all the punishment from dying when you are trying to experiment, you have new skills you know, you're testing this game and boom you're dead and you're losing your world tier. It's laughable for me, of course we have tons of technical issues, problems with servers, glitches, I basically each hour I experience some kind of glitch or issue, oh, that, that's really frustrating, 
when that happens at the wrong moment. You know what I'm trying to say. Basically, I had a couple of situations where I basically killed the boss and the servers died and I had to repeat the whole level again because the game died. It's uh, Right now it's a little bit tricky and uh, yeah, of course we don't have any sharing opportunities between uh, teammates and um, who cares I guess. Uh, yeah, thank you for watching and uh, ah, who cares. See ya bastards. Bye.